Okay, this is probably gonna be the shortest intro I can possibly do because I'm already here and I'm really excited. I've got the camera propped upon an air vent. I didn't even have time for the tripod. <laughs> Today I am meeting the gorgeous Cheryl from Uberloo's Photography. I love her style, I love her photography. Um, I'm going to be following Cheryl around and just giving you guys a bit of a glimpse of what your wedding photographers actually do for you on your wedding day. I'm really interested to see how she does the ceremony without kind of getting in the way or being noticeable. It's a bit rainy, which is a bit of a shame, but hopefully it's blowing over quite quickly, so hopefully they'll be able to get some lovely shots outside. Look, I'll show you, let me turn you around. It's, it's so far so good, look. I'm gonna get inside, have a little look around, um, I'm gonna find Cheryl, and then we'll go from there. dangerous. <laughs> so I've just been talking with Cheryl about how we're going to work the ceremony because I don't want to be in the background of all their lovely photos obviously. I'll be at the front for the first bit Yeah. and then after we start the register I'll come down to the back Yeah. and then I'll shoot backwards and I'll walk out backwards so if you always stay on one side of the room yeah. we won't be in the same okay. shot. So I won't be ruining their wedding photos. No. <laughs> You're all holstered up. I'm holstered up, good to go. <laughs> <laughs> So I've got to try and stay at the same side as Cheryl so that I don't get in any of her shots and ruin this lovely couple's wedding photos forever. Can I leave that? You can. Thank you. I've been trusted with something. <laughs> We're deciding if we can get photos outside. 
It's dodgy. So I give him a chance to have a drink. Yeah. <laughs> what are they? Hiding in the toilets because it's the only place that's quiet. Um, but watching Cheryl work, it's amazing. Like the way the way she gets the shots without kind of getting in the way or without being too posing, it's incredible. And she's such a good people person. Like everyone is roaring with laughter <laughs> at her directing people for where to go for the photos. Like she's she's very talented, very good at what she does. Um, and it's not just having a good camera, it's not just being able to take good photos, you've got to be part of the wedding party as well essentially you're you're in the thick of the biggest moments of their life photographer so hats off to them it was really good to see a bit of behind the scenes of what they actually do and how hard they work thanks to Cheryl again for having me thank you to the Mill Barns thank you to the gorgeous couple for letting me tag along and get some little snippets of their big day oh god it's cold so yeah I was only there for like two and a half three hours um, and it's hard work what the photographers do like it's actually a lot more physical than you'd expect like I know my job's quite physical because I'm you know running around helping lay tables tweak these last things and keeping track of everybody but you actually think a photographer is just kind of like point shoot move a bit point shoot. it's really not she's constantly alert constantly looking at what's going on trying to get the next good shot um but she's fantastic it, it's quite chilly today it's eight degrees but because it's a little bit drizzly and rainy it's feels quite a lot colder and she literally got them out she knew exactly what photos they wanted because they'd had a engagement shoot before so she got them outside she got exactly the photos they wanted she kept them laughing kept them relaxed um and they got all the photos they wanted in like five minutes so she's an absolute pro it was really good to see it so i think my big takeaway from this is choose your photographer wisely they are a really big part of your day they are there for some of the most intimate moments you see all these photos of people's weddings where it's them you know snuggling and kissing obviously the photographers had to be there to get that shot they're right there right with you really up close when you're kissing and smooching so i think really choose somebody that you're comfortable with that you think your guests will get on with as well because they're such a big part of the day and mingling around with your guests i just think choose your photographer wisely i think it's definitely worth every Every single penny to get a good photographer I think that's where people should really put quite a bit of their budget into because these photos are gonna be with you forever obviously put a bit of budget into your coordinator as well <laughs> a good photographer 
is worth their weight in gold. If there's any other vendors that you want me to go along with, I've obviously been to a dress shop, I've been to a wedding cake maker, and now I've been with a photographer. If there's any other vendors that you think I should tag along with for the day and get a bit of behind the scenes info on, um, let me know and I will probably do it. So, <laughs> so yeah, throw any suggestions my way. Thank you for watching. If you liked the video, pop it a like down below. Um, even better if you would like to subscribe to see what else is coming up in the future, that would be great. Thanks for watching. Bye!